Alright guys, I'm going to show you the DS File Explorer. I don't know if it's just this, it can't be the box, but I just downloaded it like two weeks ago from APK Time and I downloaded it just today from APK Time and check this new one out. This ES File Explorer Pro. But look at that. Nice new design on it. You got all your tools here. First thing I always do, I shut off the recycle bin. So when you delete something out of here, it doesn't go to your recycle bin. It, it just disappears, it goes straight away. So that's your tools. You got your network. And I always add my Google Drive here so I can just send stuff to my Google Drive. Um, we got your library and your local. So it'll be your home page, then your home home page. Click on shows you how much room you got left on your device. Click up here, shows you all the apps you got. Oops. And then you just go back, you just hit that X. See it has everything that you have open up here. And the favorite section. So you can just go right here, Google opens up your browser. Let's get a let's get Aptoid. And this right here, this en.aptoid.com, that's what you want. So we can install Aptoid. And when you get the ES File Explorer, that's it just downloads right to that. It uses that to download. And you just open file, install install and now we have Aptoid so we can go back 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 and now we can go to our local home page apps and we can open app toward right here and you can just you can sit in that ES file explorer and just so we'll skip that and the thing about app toid it keeps you up to date on what needs updated you can just go over here, update all, and then it'll update them. But we're going to search. We're going to get Morpheus. Morpheus TV. Right here. Morpheus TV. See that green shield? That means it's a trusted download. And then you can can also see that it was coming straight from the Morpheus TV store. You can always just check out. But that green shield that's trusted. So would you like to allow install app after download? Yes. Allow access to your phone store so we can download and install this app. Yes. These devices are all rooted, so you gotta go through that.
done enough. Get over there. Get over there. Get over there. Get over there. See if we got it. It might be installed already. Let's back out of that. And we will go to our wait. Let's go back to this second one. Go to download. You can erase all these. You don't need all these anymore. Where were we at here? Morpheus TV. Let's open it up. Might as well, right? Click allow. It says the author does not host or upload any of the content. And we're on the updated version is 1.44. What I'd like to do is uh I disable subtitles. But if you have buffer issues you just play around with these numbers so you get a little buffer and then here's a if you want to enable it to put it in your Kodi enable that video scraper it'll download into that SD card download it'll download this plugin then you install from zip and Kodi and then you'll have Morpheus TV and Cody. Verify found sources to make sure they are not dead links. Enabling this option will make the scraping process slower. So when it's scraping for sources, if you want them to go faster, just disable that. I don't mind it because I just skip it. I'll show you here. Movies. And then you can also hear, I set up a tracked account because somebody said that it doesn't sync with the tracked account. So hold on, let me make sure my phone's ready. So my collection. So then you gotta go to your phone or laptop. Just kind of like setting up real the brick. Just type in HTTPS. colon forward slash forward slash tracked tv slash activate sign in Punch in that code E five four D that looks like a zero to me. And if it's not a zero, just go back and try the O. Oops, I typed an E. Continue. Allow Morpheus TV to use your account? Yes. So there you go. Synced up with mine. So let's go on here. Trending. Last Star Wars. I'm just picking a movie just to show you how it works. Let's see. Here's that timer. And you don't you don't have to let it go all the way. But this shows you the pings.
open it up, shows you the quality. But the faster these pings, the faster it's going to load up for you. And then this breaks it down even more. This breaks it down into 1080 HD unknown. This breaks it down in your sizes. And then this just this is just a general of the sources and then you open it up and it shows you even more sources so but if you're looking for a specific source this is what you do so you got your putt lockers and we get one two three So you just click, starts playback for you. If I had them subtitles on, then it would search for the subtitles, and then you can automatically download the best one or whatnot. And plays. Just like that. Same thing TV shows. I don't have anything on my track account for TV shows, but you just sync it up. So anyway, but yeah, you can do torrents, you can enable torrent, get your VPN and whatnot. And your downloads, your sources, and then you can turn off any of these that you don't want and it won't scrape for them. Verify timeout in seconds, so you can speed all that stuff up if you're that impatient, but you don't have to wait for that whole thing to go. You can pick a pick a source at any time. And here's all your providers. Uncheck them if you want. go here and put in the username and password if you want to use that um, subtitles we already went on. I just didn't disable that if you want them you can always shut them off after the movie starts too but I just I don't deal with them so and your player so if it buffered then I just kick it up to like five or ten so it gets a nice five second five or ten second buffer zone um, the minimum buffer is kick it up to 30 so it stays ahead the maximum you know do like 60 or speed it up depending on your device and your internet so that's how you get Aptoid and uh, Morpheus TV like and subscribe